victory. People <laughs> are slapping at me. Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of Girl Talk. Oh, girl. We're going to be buying some teachers gifts because our teachers need to be appreciated when it's winter coming to winter break because they do so much work for us and we're very very excited so we're gonna be going to Michaels and Bath and Body Works and a bunch of fun places and so what we did before is we brainstormed some ideas and wrote down all of our teachers that we have so we wrote it down on our little list right here I have one boy teacher and then two girls and then I'm also going to be going to a white elephant well actually it's at our house so I needed to get a gift for a white elephant party so that's what I'm going to be shopping for. Three teachers and one gift. I'm going to be shopping for eight teachers. Surprisingly, they're all girls. And then I am going to a white elephant party this weekend at a dance friend's house, so I had to buy a gift for that. All right, so let's head to the stores and see what happens. Woo! They're 50% That's crazy. We got little baggies to fit the little soaps in. Look how crazy this is. This is ridiculous. I love Rice Krispie Treats, but they're always so tiny. And so a huge one. <laughs> so you eat like four? <laughs> yeah. And then awesome. look, it's two pounds of just oh my gosh, candy cane. candy cane. It's a mint twist. So this would be such a good white elephant gift. Yes. It would get stolen so three fast. times. It's like a bookstore, but for candy. And I found this little flip-up mirror that's white and black plaid. And then I found these cute little sleepy masks to go with them. And there happened to be eight of each. So I think I'm gonna try and slip these into the little bags that I put in the soaps. I don't know whether uh, I should stick with white ribbon or just do black ribbon or even use the golden silk. I need Annie's expertise. I think this is really cute. Like, it looks really awesome, but then I also like the gold ribbon a lot. And this isn't as Christmassy. Yeah. With the black. I'm looking around, so I have three teachers, two girls and one guy, and then I have a white elephant gift. So I'm not sure exactly what I want to do yet. They have like a whole bunch of squishies. So my friends love squishies a lot and they're really into like a slime and stuff like I am. So I feel like squishies would be a really cute white elephant gift. So I'm thinking about it. I think I would get like a big one like this and then like a baby one like this little. I would totally love to get this. Oh my goodness gracious lation. Hot cocoa mix, raspberry flavored hot cocoa mix, French vanilla, peppermint, double chocolate, toasted marshmallow, hazelnut, salted caramel. I have to get these. Do two for each teacher. All right, we're all ready. I think everything looks so awesome. Okay, so this is all of our stuff. I decided I didn't want to put pants on for this video, so I'm wearing my onesie <laughs> pants. Naturally. So, just ignore that, guys. Oh my gosh, everything looks so adorable. So we're gonna start packaging up everything and making it look all cute and ready. So this is my white elephant gift. I'm just gonna set it aside because I'm not packaging this up just now because I'm not going to the white elephant yet. I know hot chocolate is like super cliche and they're probably gonna get so much hot chocolate, but this one I saw at Michael's and it was really cool. So they're like little box and there's like vanilla, peppermint, marshmallow, salted caramel, gingerbread, like hot chocolate. Like it's not just normal. I wanted to get this so bad. So I did. Like who does not want peppermint flavored hot chocolate? So, I'm, since I have three teachers, I'm going to do two and two, and then I'm not going to give the raspberry or the hazelnut to anyone, because that's kind of gross. So, I'll eat them. Yeah, okay. So, I'm going to start opening it this up. Me? I got these soaps. I got multiple different colors. So, I got pink, so yellow, blue, purple, green, all the colors. And then, what I plan to do is I'm going to use these longer kind of bags, and I'm going to fit the soaps inside them. I'm also going to put these two matching accessories. This is the little mirror. And this is an adorable sleeping mask. And then I'm going to tie the top together with this silver uh, ribbon that I got. It's kind of shimmery. I got, I got this paper that's completely sparkly, so I'm going to cut out little cards that say to Miss Rebecca from Lily or something like that. So I'm pretty excited. Where is my what black string? 
Okay, so I think I'm gonna be putting my little hot chocolate in those baggies and then wrapping it up with the string that actually came on the box because it's plaid and so Christmassy. And then I'm gonna make little cards that say like from Annie, like blah blah blah. So let's get started. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it's gonna be so hard to decide which teacher I should give which color to. Yeah. I think I'm gonna give pink to my favorite teachers. Ooh. Maybe. Because pink is my favorite color. So I'm just fitting everything in here, making it look all pretty and organized in the little baggie. Does that look organized? No, not really. But it's all in there. Yeah, that's cute. Yeah. I'm really excited about these hot chocolate. They're so adorable and they're like little mini boxes. Can you hold this close while I tie it around? This is not working well. We need mom in here so she can do it. I know, we need mom. Mom, no. We're not very good at crafts. No, I'm so not a crafty. Oh my gosh. No, I said no, it's over the. I'm so not a crafty person. Like, I, I can barely tie my own shoes. Yeah, I can't. <laughs> well, actually, I can, but like. There, that looks feisty. Feisty. And Christmassy, and looks like I put a lot of effort into it, which I did. <laughs> Which I did. Because before this, we were just going to go to Bath and Body Works and buy some soap because we knew they had prepackaged ones. But when we got there, they were like six, eight dollars. Like they were kind of yeah, expensive, they were expensive. And we were only getting a soap. So we were like, you know, if we go to Michael's, we could just spend the same amount of money but get two or three more things into the yeah. like little package if you have the time to do, put all the effort in, or you just want to spend the money right then and there, have it prepackaged, pre-wrapped. Yeah. So it's like time really is money, I guess. <laughs> if you see, I don't know, I never really understood that until now. Hmm. For the male teacher, I'm gonna do the double chocolate and gingerbread flavored chocolate mix. I'm thinking is I want to wrap the string around the box and then do a little bow at the top so they stay together so they're not just like falling over and then place them carefully inside one of these little gift bags and then put name tags on them. I think that'll look really, really pretty. So we're both using the gift bags then. <coughs> yeah. I almost got it. So that's kind of sad. Victory. Victory. A purpley one and I'll put a sleeping mask and a matching mirror. Oh my gosh, I love these. They're so cute. Because usually my mom just goes out at like midnight one night and goes and buys little teacher's yeah. gifts. And then I don't actually know what I'm giving my teacher. I just hope that it's good. So this yeah. year, I decided to put in the effort because, you know, you just gotta take ownership. Yeah, yeah, and they work so incredibly hard for us, guys. Like, you don't understand. You think doing your homework is a lot, mm -hmm. but imagine the teacher having to look to and grade oh. and, and like correct everyone in your class's homework. Like, that's a lot. And they have to do that all in the same amount of time. And on top of that, they also have to prepare to lead the whole class. Like, you generally just have to prepare for like a presentation, take some notes. Like, do you kind of, as a student, you kind of do the minimum, but the teacher has to make a plan for the whole hour, hour and a half, however long you're actually in the class. So yeah. they do so much behind the scenes and in class. I okay. definitely deserve appreciation. I'm tying my little hot cocoa boxes together. Ooh, guys, look how cute this looks. They all actually look really good together. Like if I put them in a cute box and assorted yeah. them nicely. Mm. Can you open this? No. We should sing for them. We should Christmas caroling. Mm. All silver bells, sweet silver bells. Lily, that's not. But I'm such a good singer. <laughs> Christmas is literally my favorite time of the year. I know. So if you were playing White Elephant, Annie, what yes. would your ideal gift be? Would you like a gag gift or would you like food or what kind of gifts would you like? Girl, I hate gag gifts. Really? I, oh, I think they're funny. I, love I mean, I gifts. think they're funny when other people get them. <laughs> Seriously, <laughs> I, wore, I, I wore my cute outfit for this. Like, you know what I mean? I think the cutest gift would be is like a fuzzy blanket or like a robe just because like it's such a good gift that you only have to buy like one thing. Like you don't have to buy a whole bunch of stuff. That's what I was originally going for, but we couldn't find any like robes or blankets that I liked at Michael's. 
Um, that's why we went with the squishies because I know the people at My White Elephant are really into slime and squishies. But I would love to get like a robe or like a blanket or like a sweater or something like comfortable. With like a chocolate, you. with like a chocolate bar. Yeah, I remember one time I was at a white elephant party. I was probably like nine or something. <laughs> and like everyone, I was one of the last ones. I think there were 23 people. I was number 19. Yikes. And uh, like everyone had such good gifts. And I knew what I was going to steal. Like I, I had my eyes set on it. I can't even remember what it was now. But man, I was sold on that one. But then it got stolen. And then it got stolen again. And it got stolen three times, so I couldn't steal it, and I was devastated. Oh. So I was like, oh, whatever, I guess my plan is foiled. So I went to the middle, and I grabbed something, and I opened it. And it was this, like, old 80s movie that was supposed to be a gag gift for one of the older parents. Oh. It was called, like, Butterfingers or something. I can't even remember, but I was so disappointed. I actually, I think I almost cried. <laughs> I was Because oh. when I was really little, I, I don't know why. I was so competitive. Like, I kind of still am now. I've chilled out a lot, though. Yeah. But, like, I was competitive to the point where I would cry or I would get, like, emotional trauma if I didn't, like, win. Oh, my God. So, oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that was a pretty traumatic story. For once, I went to, it's not, like, really funny, but, like, I once went to a white elephant and my dad got, like, a whole set of those, like, really disgusting, like, um, candies that you open the lids and then a piece of candy comes out. Pez? Yeah. Yeah. I love those. They're disgusting. It, they taste like the edible bracelets, and my dad got one, and I stole it from him. I love him. Pez. <laughs> he got, like, a whole bunch, and they were, like, Disney princesses. But other than that, I don't really have, like, anything, like, interesting in white elephants, but they're so much fun. They are fun. Like, getting to see what everybody else gets. And, and like, who steals what. It's yeah. so funny. And it's just so seasonal, and it's just like, yes. Seven, eight. Okay, so we're done. I decided to add little candy canes in all of my little gift bags. I think they look awesome. The plaid is so pretty. And then also the red ribbon that we got from Michaels. I think they look so adorable. We decided to hole punch out little tags so you can write down like to and from. And I think they look so good. And the little silver matches really well. So I'm really excited with my gift. So we got the same tags. And we wrote to and from on there. And all the colors look really cute together. Come below what your favorite subject is and comment down below if it's because of the subject or the teacher because if you're a good teacher then you like the subject mm -hmm. just saying i'm so excited for christmas and we will see you guys next tuesday bye, bye.